What's uh? I mean, the UFC deal's done. What's the emotion like right now? It's uh. I'm gonna put it this way. If I got it last year, I'd probably be crazy now. But the whole point of getting to this year was we I plan we planned on it. So it's pretty much uh, going to pick up a package, get the strap, as 50 Cent would say. But I don't think that means that. But anyway, it sounds good, <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> how'd, you, how'd you feel about your performance this evening? Because you, know, you, you had a good fight the last time you were here too, but um, much more dominant this evening. Yeah, um, I th- I, what I took, I, I kept technique, but I felt just more like a, just an animal. I just this, this camp coming right off of that fight, it just was like really grinding and I just kept going and kept going. I definitely, now I have to, uh, a quota, I have something to keep up when I go back, you know. It's, uh, I grind, I grind, I grind. Of course, you gotta do it smart, but at the same time, I did this and now I have another, uh, what you, uh, a marker. If I do anything less than what I did this time around, you know, so now I have to do that. So, damn. What was it like after leaving the first time? You know, kind of, Half having a deal, not having a deal. I, mean, I, was, I was just happy about the W. And then they gave me a pretty good scholarship, and they made my life a little, a lot more, a lot easier and stuff like that. So, man, even after the fight, I was like, man, I want to go. Everybody want to go to UFC. This is what we're doing. Um, but it was more like I'm like, probably wasn't even ready. The first thing that came to my mind was like, yo, what if that was Musasi or something? You know. So I definitely understood that. It was hard pill to swallow, but I understood, and I knew I had some stuff to do, and even now, still got more to do. You know, so. How much improvement do you think you made? Because it looked like a lot. I mean, we're only talking about one fight difference between right. then and now, right? right? But I think we all kind of say, oh, he looks very improved. Well, I think from the last fight, uh, a lot of people were respecting a lot. And I think that fight was just more for me to uh, play around. I'm not saying that my opponent, my last opponent was uh, someone to play with, but definitely felt like I should have. This was a, it was a heart. It was, it meant to like, you know, for me to show heart, show some skill. And this fight was just more a, hey, you come back on the show. You got a knockout last time. So obviously something was missing. So let's get it finished, but let's do it a little different. Let's do it right. Let's be a little more savage. Let's, let's be nasty. Yeah. So what's the, what's the move for you now? I mean, you got the deal under your belt, but uh, you know, is it, let's jump in there right away. Is it, let's take some time. What do you, what do you think? I want to jump in right away. I want to take some time. It's like uh, all in, I'm not talking about vacation or nothing like that. I'm talking about uh, just getting better. I got to get better. I got to keep feeling the pressure that I've been feeling, the pressure as far as uh, my teammates put on me and stuff like that, my, you know, some of my, clo- my coaches and stuff like that, just uh, grinding and stuff like that. Stick to the plan. Stay, stay ready. Um, keep executing. Most importantly, be myself. None of your fan base was on point tonight. It was, they right? were uh, chanting contracts right after the night. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What was that like? How many people did you have here? Uh, it was, uh, it was uh, 15, wow. maybe. I don't know. Do you usually have a good traveling fan base anytime you fight? I like to say so, but I mean, I have my family, uh, my mother, my father, my brother, and you know, the coaches and my manager. That's usually the, the those who can be there physically. But uh, still, it, it did feel a lot larger this time. What are they I the first one? It. My parents were. You know. I mean, but the first one was sort of like a, the, like the beta testing. You know, we didn't even know we could bring more people in. We had like a set amount of people to bring in. So I did that. And uh, I, wouldn't, I, wouldn't, I was afraid to even ask for another ticket. So, <laughs> <laughs> so, so this time around, I was like, you know, I got a really good manager in Rick Guerrero. And uh, he definitely pulled the, you know, he did, he, he did, he pulled through. And he got me what I needed for this fight big time. Well, I think we learned that, you know, when you get the win, you can ask for things. We were lucky enough, the last guy that came in here, he had names. He had people he already thought about that he would want to fight against. Yeah. So you've thought about Wait, this. But every, sure yeah, everybody. We, all right, so if I'm going to middleweight, I got to fight everybody. So we got to fight Stylebender, right? We got to fight the champ. We got to, hopefully, we got to fight Yo Romero. We got to <laughs> <laughs> we gotta fight. We got to fight the top 10. We got to fight the top 15, top 20. So I'm here, and um, I mean, that's what I'm here for, so. It's more than just the belt. I, it's a test to myself. Uh, I started martial arts. I started MMA because I want to fight the best. It don't change. It does not change no matter where I go. What do you think about Stylebender performance this past weekend? I thought it was good, man. It was just a, he just makes for a good matchup and uh, just yeah. I think me and him could do man. Fuck. <laughs> Say your piece. Say yeah, your piece. man. Just you know, it's it's a fight at the end of the day. And if me and him have one day, maybe next day. And we got to fight. You already know I'm looking for the win, so 
straight up. But uh, other than that, like, I like Style Bender. I like his style. I like everything he stands for. I even like how he's, you know, he like he likes the um, what is that anime and stuff mm -hmm. like that. He's, yeah, I like Style Bender. But yeah. But like I said, we fight everybody. We fight everybody. We gotta, we got to. Yeah. Yeah, you've already met. I mean, you yeah. said after you didn't make it the last time, you thought, what if that was gay? What if that was Masasi? So you, yeah. so you know where my mind is. I'm yeah. not thinking about. I'm thinking about the top ten because that's where I'm gonna be. Yep. Well, I'm actually, champion. But still, that's where I'm gonna be. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Well done. Thank, Thank you, you very much. much. Appreciate it. Congratulations. Man.